Now we return to a segment back by popular demand, the Blitz board with the king of the sheesh, <laughs> the beast from the weast. Kelly Burkhart, take it away for some brackets, my man. Sheesh. Let's check out the substate brackets, guys. Let's start in class 6A. Gardner Edgerton will face off against Olathe Northwest. And a rematch from week one, it's Manhattan and Derby. In class 5A, Mill Valley will face Blue Valley Southwest. And Mays returns to Substate, this time facing Hayes. Moving on to 4A, Bishop Miege will face St. Thomas Aquinas. And in the other game, it's Wamigo facing McPherson. Next, we head to 3A, Topeka Hayden facing Holton. And Clay Center facing the defending 3A champs, Andale. We check in on class 2A, Sabetha will face Nemaha Central, and the other game will feature Southeast to Celine and Kingman. We move down to Class 1A, St. Mary's will face Centralia, and in a rematch from Week 7, Conway Springs will face Inman. We move to 8-man Division 1, Burling game will face Little River, and Hill City faces Leota, Wichita County. And finally, we finish with 8-man Division 2, Canton Galva facing Axtell, and Thunder Ridge faces Dighton better. Mm, thank you, K. Boo. You are just unlike anything else. You just do it week in and week out. You saw that with Migo. They took down Andover Central when the only area teams we couldn't get highlights of. But it's okay. It wasn't the best effort for them. But a great season for the Jags. After the break, we'll talk a little college football. KSU needs a win this weekend. We'll see if they can do it. Stick around. We'll be right back.